Howdy folks, this is Tex Screbner with Tex Screbner Outdoors. And uh, this is actually a deer season, pre-season report for you guys. Kind of a deer forecast, so to speak. Uh, because with all the rain we're getting here in Illinois, especially the central part. Um, anyways, with all the rain that we're getting, uh, it's been really hard to uh, get crops in the ground and it's the end of May uh, and we're just getting started to plant corn and uh, we haven't even started beans yet we've got some wheat in the ground but uh, that means that it's going to be a hard deer season so uh, you're going to want to get out there early on in the season before everything gets spooked obviously this is for you bow hunters out there and uh, because we're having such a crazy spring here in 2009 and uh, crazy early summer um, it's gonna be a weird deer season uh, 2008 there basically was a nocturnal rut and uh, with those crops still in really late into the fall this year I can guarantee you that they're gonna be in very late um, or until very late in the harvest season just because we're getting them in the ground so late so uh, try and get out opening day and uh, also uh, if you're a bow hunter fill those doe tags and don't be afraid to take yearling does because those are the deer that fuck up the rut because they come into estrus either too early or too late and it really strings out the rut and it makes deer harder to pattern so I hope that's helpful uh, I've been seeing a lot of deer um, I saw quite a few when I was coyote hunting over on my other spot um, but uh, and I've seen a lot of them alongside the road at night but realistically y'all know this we see them all year round until the bullets and arrows start flying and you know that you're never gonna fucking see them when you're on the stand so uh, get out there opening day of the 2009 deer season whatever opening day it is and uh, I think that there's good potential but with the crops staying in as late as they're probably going to be in, uh, deer movement, they're going to be hard to spot. They're going to be holding up in the corn. There's going to be a lot of food, and they're going to be really hard to pattern and uh, profile their movements. And uh, make sure to take those yearling does so they don't screw up the rut. So, as always, God bless all my Ted and Agent Blood Brothers out there. Join the NRA to protect our rights. Thank you very much to those of you involved in law enforcement and serving the military. And thank you to my subscribers for all of your support. I will always do my best for you. Uh, I've only gotten one deer in my entire life. And um, I hope to get a couple more this season. But uh, thanks for watching. Hope that's helpful.